Hi friends, this is Sujit Gattam. Today we are going to learn about our respiratory system, lungs. The lungs are the primary organs of the respiratory system in humans and many other animals including a few fish and some snails. In mammals and most other vertebrates, two lungs are located near the backbone of either side of the heart. Their function in the respiratory system is to extract oxygen from the atmosphere and transfer it into the bloodstream and to release carbon dioxide from the bloodstream into the atmosphere. In a process of gas exchange, respiration is driven, uh, driven by different muscular systems in different species. Mammals, reptiles and birds use the different muscles to support faster breathing. In early tet tetrapods, air was driven into the lungs by the muscles via buccal pumping. A mechanism still seen in amphibians. In humans, the main muscle of respiration that drives breathing is diaphragm. The lungs also provide airflow that make that makes vocal sounds, including human speech, possible. Humans have two lungs: a right lung and left lung. They are situated within the thoracic cavity of the chest. The right lung is bigger than the left, which shares spaces in the chest with the heart. The lungs together weigh approximately 1.3 kilograms and the right is heavier. The lungs are the part of the low respiratory tract that begins at the trachea and branches to bronchi and bronchitis, and which receive air breathed in the via the conducting zone. The conducting zone end, ends at the terminal bronchitis. The, this divides into respiratory bronchitis of the respiratory zone which divides into the alveolar ducts that give rise to the alveolar sacs. Uh, that contain the alveoli, where gases uh, gas exchange takes place. Alveoli are approximately 2400 kilometers of airways and 300 to 500 million alveoli. Each lung is enclosed with a floral sac that contain fluoride fluid, which allows the inner and outer walls to slide over each and visual breathing takes place without much friction. The sac also divides each lung into the uh, different sections called lobes. The right lung has three lobes and left lung has two. The lobes are further divided into segments and, of and lobes. The lungs have unique blood supply, receiving deoxygenated blood from the heart in the pulmonary circulation for the purposes of receiving oxygen and releasing carbon dioxide and a separate supply of oxygenated blood of the tissue of the lungs in the bronchial circulation. Lung diseases are the some of the most common medical conditions in the world. Tens of millions of the people have lung diseases in the US alone. Smoking, infection and genes cause most lung diseases. Your lungs are a part of a complex system expanding and relaxing thousands of times each day to bring in oxygen and send out to carbon dioxide. Lung disease can happen where there are problems in any part of the system. Lung disease is affecting the airways. Your windpipe, trachea, branches into the tubes called bronchi, which in turn become smaller tubes throughout your lungs. Diseases that can uh, affect these airways include asthma. Your waves are constantly inflamed and may spam, causing wheezing and Shortness of breath, allergies, infection or pollution can trigger asthma symptoms. COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. With the long condition, you can't exhale the, the way you usually causes without trouble breathing. Chronic bronchitis, the form of COPD brings a long term wet curve. Emphysemia, lung damage allows to be air trapped in your lungs in the form of COPD. Trouble blowing out is called hallmark. Acute bronchitis. The sudden infection of your airways is usually caused by a virus. Cystic fibrosis. With this condition, you have trouble clearing mucus out of your bronchi. This lead to repeated lung infections.